How's it going ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to AdventureCraft. It's been a long time since I've actually played AdventureCraft, but I figure why not let's get back into it uh, with another video series. Uh, last time I played it, I played um, a Legend of Zelda map, and I figured let's do another one. This one is uh, it's called Legend of Zelda The Shadowgate. I've never seen anything of this, so this is going to be fresh to me. Let's see how well this goes. Uh, whoa, the music is a little loud, but that's okay. <coughs> Excuse me if my voice sounds a little more raspy than usual and everything. I went to Six Flags yesterday, and uh, me being at Six Flags, I just screamed nonstop, not only for my personal entertainment, but also for the entertainment of my friends. And, uh, ooh, hello, guide. How are you? Oh, that didn't do anything. What did I do? Oh, I opened my inventory. Ah, okay. Uh, do not distribute the... that. Alright, well, I guess I'm walking. Uh, are you gonna do anything? No? Thank you for downloading this AdventureCraft map. Let us discuss a few things before we get started. First things first, and this is a demo version of the map. It includes the first chapter of the map. If you like the map or would rather play the full version, you will need to stop by the upgrade map version room. In it, you will find a few URL links that you can activate by pressing the wall button. For more info on how that room works, just visit it. To brush up on a few things, visit the general info room, which can be found to your left. You ought to start there even if you have played previous versions of this map, as it contains instructions related to the dialogue. If you would like to alter the resolutions of textures of that map usage, visit the graphic settings room. To begin the journey, enter the chapter 1 warp. Finally, we are at Nano Edge Entertainment. Uh, welcome you to the El Eloys? I don't know. We hope you enjoy your stay. Okay, well, I guess we're going. Uh, now let's take a look. We have ourselves the training info room. Uh, what do you have to- Ooh! Holy crap! And this is why I like Zelda mods. Uh, while you may know the basis of adventure crap, this map uses an advanced set of scripting features. For example, when pressing the P key on your keyboard, you instantly teleport to this area. Oh. When you are ready to resume your adventure, simply press P key again and it will return to where you were. You can interact with P NPCs by clicking them, but I must tell you that their current system is a little buggy. Dialogue will always work, but if you're not standing still for before clicking on the NPC, your screen will shake. Whenever you pick up a new item, a dialogue box will appear on the screen. Once you have read the dialogue, simply enter and hit the enter key to exit. Okay. Interesting. Now what do we have in here? We have ourselves press button to activate, lever to pull to activate. Okay, that's pretty self-explanatory. Uh, apply pressure. Yes, I know all these things. Thank you. Okay, I am going to see if I can grab any of this stuff. Can I grab you? Uh, oh, okay. Let's see what it says about the ocarina. The ocarina allows you to play songs by using number of keys on your keyboard. You will learn songs on your quest that have various effects. That is cool. Uh, I am very much looking forward to that. All right, wait, do I hit enter? There we go. Okay. Uh, we have upgrade map version room. Okay. Uh, let's take a look. Full download version available. Okay, I didn't do anything. Map thread. All right. Let's take a look at this. Uh, you'll need to do 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 do. Uh, I will get that later. No worries about that right now. I will get that later. Chapter selection room. Okay. <clears throat> Here we go. Where's chapter one? Chapter one, Brightwood Meadows. Let's go. We're in Brightwood Meadows. Ooh. Zelda music. I am very much enjoying this so far. What do we got here? Anything in the chest? We have ourselves a red rupee. I will take that. Thank you very much. Uh, well, there's more chests in there? There was. Nothing in it, though. Uh, is that a chest? No, it's not. It's a, just a nightstand. <clears throat> Alright, so let's take a look. Um, nothing else in here, so we're gonna leave. Wait, wait, actually, wait a minute. There was a door over there, now that I think about it. Oh, I keep thinking this is like regular Minecraft, but it's not. There was a door here, but I didn't realize it. This leads us to the backyard! And, uh, Link has a very fabulous backyard. Not very big or very full of things. Ah, look at that. Charles is waiting for us. Well, have no fear, Charles. I am on my way. Uh, I'm going to take a look over here real quick, see if we got anything. But uh, we have nothing, so we just came out here for the scenic route. Actually, wait a minute. Yeah, wait. Is that a chest? That is not a chest. That is all good. Now, some fans do remember me back when I did my uh, original Zelda Adventure Craft Let's Play, and uh, even though I never beat it, it was still a lot of fun, and I really wanted to go back to it, and I'm glad I came back to this one. Hey, Link! It's good to see you, Charles. I'm glad to see you as well. I have a message for you from Olaf. He said that you need to go see him, and he said that it was urgent. Okay, I'll go do that. Where can I find him? Olaf said that he would meet you by the bridge. Follow the path to your left. He should be waiting for you there. Okay. 
pretty self-explanatory. Uh, thank you, Charles. I can take it from here. So, Olaf. The old, well, the bearded man. Okay, Charles, thank you very much for the help. I am going to be moving on. Uh, let's take a look at the locals. We have Brett Woods Meadows. It's a shop. Gloria. Hey, a Link, beautiful day, huh? Oh, what do we have in the shop? This is cool. 20 rupees for 15. We get milk or we can get... Oh. So one rupee equates to one arrow. I like that. Not too, not too bad. Not bad of a trade at all. Uh, what else have we got? We have got something in here. In here we have... Veronica, I think Sammy was looking for you. And we have Jeremy. We're selling milk from our farm. Okay. Anything in here? No, this just leads us outside. Well, we are going to go visit Olaf. Uh, let's take a look. Wait, actually, nope. We have more down here. This is probably just an inn or something. Oh, a chest. Ooh, rupees. Thank you. Uh, we're, yep, we're just moving on. Moving on up. Anyways. Anyways, guys, if you guys have um, other adventure craft maps that you would like to see me do, uh, be sure to let me know because um, I will be doing a um, amnesia one. That uh, if you saw the intro, you saw that I had multiple maps, and this is just one of the few. And uh, amnesia happened to be one of them, and I'm looking forward to playing that very much. Uh, no trespassing. All right, well, I'm not gonna do that. Mostly because I really don't want to get things going that I don't that I can't fix. Uh, no trespassing. The door does open, but. I'm not going to take a look in there. What do we have over here? This wasn't my house. But, uh, yeah, a lot of people loved the, the Minecraft videos and everything. And uh, even when, when I stopped, people still continued to watch them for a very long time. And um, I have honestly, like, been... What, what do we have here? I've been meaning to get back into Minecraft stuff and everything, but I just never did. Hey, Nick, how are we doing? I, whoops. I didn't want to do that. Here, let's back out. Can I back out? Just take the people's letters like that, give it back to them? Oh, really? But I... But... Fine, I'll give it back. But I'm a little thirsty right now. Could you buy me a bottle of milk? Okay. We're gonna go buy Nick a bottle of milk and get a letter from him, which hopefully will actually be useful to us uh, later down the road. Uh, Alright, folks, I will take that. How do you, how do you buy it? That'll do it. Alright, Nick, we are gonna quench your thirst. Ah... <sighs> Now here's the thing, Nick, you just robbed me of quite a few rupees just for the fact that you live on the other side of the wall. Hey Link, wanna see something cool? What sort of trouble have you gotten yourself into this time? Uh, but I didn't get into trouble all honest, don't you believe me? Uh, no. Alright, how do I say no? Oh, right click. Yeah, I knew you would believe me. Wait, no. Okay, I guess not. I was spying on Dexter the other day when I found him writing a love letter to Sammy. I saw him leave it on her doorstep, so I decided to take it. Nick, I... You can't just take people's letters like that. Give it back to him. Oh, really? But I... But... Fine, give it back. Could you give me a bottle of milk? I did. Oh, stop it. Okay, how do I give this to him? For real. Will that do it? Oh, like that. Thank you. My letter. Mine. Okay, so I think we give it back to uh, Sammy, or... Yeah. And my dog is... Adjusting himself on my lap. Anyways, uh, we uh, who is this for? Um, does it say what? It, this is the love letter. It doesn't kind of read it. I cannot read it. Uh, this is for someone. I just don't. I just don't know where to give it. I don't know where she is or where they are. Probably down here, honestly. Hopefully, anyways. But uh, yeah. So, like I said, my voice is a bit raspy. Um. Like I said, I went to Six Flags the other day, and, uh, some... Ooh, we have ourselves an ode to the Ocarina of Time. Can I do anything to these? No? I guess not. Okay. Uh, who are you? Uh, have you found my letter? Have you found my letter? Yes, I did. Oh, we got a heart! Thank you very much. Can I do anything with the heart? Nope, that's just a filler. What's in here? We have a yellow rupee! That is worth... 13, uh, 10 rupees. I always forget the rupee count. Uh, I always knew like the green and blues, and uh, I think reds were 10. And um, <clears throat> even though I played uh, Zelda ever since I was like the age, mere age of four years old, I still forgot stuff. But um, I've been meaning to play more Zelda stuff again, and I've been itching to play it actually. And um, part of me has actually even wanted to learn how to speedrun the games, but uh, it's very difficult. 
Uh, Link, that's good. That goodness you are here. I was beginning to worry about you. It is good to see you, Olaf. Charles said that you needed to speak with me and that it was urgent. What is going on? Oh, okay. Well, I guess I'm going to skip that. Uh, your uncle left a message for you. He came to me the night before he left. I will never forget the panic that I saw in his eyes. He was so terrified, it was as if he had been visited by the monster who murdered your father. What did he tell you, Olaf? What is going on? Your uncle told me that Azrath is, is on his way to Ilos to exact the revenge on the hero's time. He said that he must delay the Dark One from finding the Hero of Shadow. Azrath is coming here? Why? He is searching for you, Link. Your mother and father defeated him and drove, drove him out of Hyrule. After his defeat at Lake Hylia, his armies were forced to retreat. Azrath escaped and vowed to destroy all those who aided the armies of Hyrule. He sent assassins to infiltrate the land and murder those responsible for his death, including your mother and father. Your mother began to have horrible visions of Hylians being slaughtered by shifters, a breed of shadow warrior that Azrath created to destroy the kingdom of Hyrule. The dreams were a warning, and she knew that Azrath would stop at nothing to destroy Hyrule. She told your father of the disturbing revelation she was experiencing, and she feared for your life, and rightfully so. On a cold, rainy evening, your mother woke in a cold sweat. She felt the presence of the shifter nearby. She knew that she, uh, th she knew that they were after you and fled to Hyrule Castle with you. Your father remained inside the castle and tried to delay the shifter so that your mo mother could escape. Uh, there were too many shifters for even your father to handle. While he fought valiantly, he fell to the shadows. Your mother sobbed as she heard the cries of pain and anguish from the castle. After an hour of running with you in your arms, your mother collapsed out of exhaustion once she reached H H Lake Hylia. God. Fearing for your life, she wandered to an old fishing shack for shelter. Whoop. After knocking on the door, she found the shelter was already occupied by a middle-aged man. The man awoke to your mother's voice, pleading with him to take, away, take you away from the land of Hyrule. The man recognized that the woman before him was none other than the Princess Zelda. He acknowledged her request and took with him to Ilos. Uh, I was realizing Ilos is actually a Mass Effect reference and I'm just mispronouncing this so badly. I'm going to say Lilo, Leos. Lios. I don't know. A faraway land from the East Termina. Link, your uncle saved your life when you were just an infant and has been protecting you from Azrath ever since. When he dreamed of Azrath's return, he knew he, that he had to stop them. I am the son of the hero Time? I thought it was just a myth. I can't believe you. who you say I am. That's impossible. Your uncle thought you might say something like that. This is why he told me of a secret place, a shrine that was built long ago. It is hidden by a waterfall to the north. Go find the shrine. It was your uncle's final request before leaving. Take the path to the left and go inside the, of the waterfall. I will. Thank you very much for everything, Olaf. I miss my uncle so much, I'll do anything to see him again. You must go. Time is short. Please be careful.